Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a bad internet connection is something we have all experienced from time to time. And just a quick video to show you a little trick I've used over the years, in case you're unaware, to resolve Wi-Fi and Ethernet connection issues. Now obviously it goes without saying that if you have tried a couple of things at first, like turning your Wi-Fi off and on to try and resolve the issue, or rebooting your router or router depending your region obviously that pronunciation will change and the connection issues are still persisting then just to show you a little trick that possibly in a lot of the cases could actually resolve any wi-fi and ethernet connectivity issues now this will apply to both windows 10 and windows 11 and it's heading over to your control panel in both OS's to enable or disable your Wi-Fi and Ethernet network adapters. So to do this and to get to control panel, I would suggest the easiest on both OS's would be to head to your search, just type in control, which will bring up control panel, click on that, and there we go. Now, if you have category view in control panel, then I would just suggest changing that from category to large or small icons. And then what you need to do is navigate over to your network and sharing center and head up to the top left where you'll see change adapter settings. So this is where your Ethernet and your Wi-Fi network adapters are located. Now in my case you can see I'm running Wi-Fi. So if I've been experiencing maybe a problem that I can't actually explain or resolve by doing some simple maintenance tasks, then this is something else you can try. So what you do is you right click and then you click on disable and just give that a second or two to disable uh, that network adapter or Wi-Fi adapter and then come back right click again and then enable and then just give that a second or two to enable and there we go and that'll just take another second or two to actually connect back to your Wi-Fi or Ethernet and there we go and that's something I've done over the years when some basic um, rebooting and turning Wi-Fi on and off doesn't work is actually to disable and then re-enable the Wi-Fi or Ethernet network adapters and in a lot of cases that actually does resolve any issues when it comes to bad internet connections. And something else just on a side note, um, if you have a device where maybe you've got a network adapter that isn't working and is maybe just causing issues, then this is something else you can actually try as well. You can just right click, click on disable and permanently disable that actual adapter just to prevent it from causing any issues with the one that's working. But nonetheless, that's how you can enable and disable your Wi-Fi and Ethernet network adapters on Windows 10 and Windows 11 to help resolve and possibly fix um, bad internet connectivity issues. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.